function rod must be moved with constant angulation the moving rod will be like a cell this is the mf this is the resistor r so I, I had to what is the strict condition the acceleration must be constant so how that force i should apply it then the induced current i this bil force let v be the velocity of the rod <coughs> then again from i is equal to blv by r that i am writing it blv by r then what is the equation we can write f minus uh, what is given the a not a not is known the rod will move with a constant acceleration what should be the nature of force find the external force applied on the rod then v of t i of t and external power is asking to calculate all this now this was that external force which i am going to apply it so initially the rod be at rest huh? Rod initially is at rest. Let's see that now B L V by R equal to M A naught. So this will be equal to B square L square V by R plus M A naught. What is V equal to further velocity of the rod at any time t? And it's a uniform acceleration. No, a naught is constant. It's telling constant acceleration. So for uniform accelerated motion, for uniform accelerated motion, so what is velocity at any time t? As it is accelerated from rest, shall we substitute this? So further, this <coughs> will be f external is equal to b square l square a naught t by r plus M A naught. Look at the type of force you should apply. You should apply a a time varying force. What is the minimum force you should apply? M A naught. The force that will be a function of time. What is the minimum force you should apply? That should be equal to M A naught. You should apply time varying force. How what about the power sol? Power gen by action agent. Again, P action. You can. <coughs> what is the velocity of the rod at any time? It is directly this much only. What is the expression for current? E by R, B L V by R, or B L A naught T by R. This is the expression for current. Power generated by action agent. P external should be equal to F external into V. Okay, I think all basic four cases I give: rod given velocity release, rod moved with a constant speed, rod pulled by a constant force, rod moved with a constant acceleration. You know, these are the basic conditions. Everywhere now, the ideas related to like this only will be revolving. Okay, instead of now the resistor, so let there be a long rail. I'll bring capacitor. Uh, 